I am an artist and book designer from Berlin. And uh, as an artist, I do books and exhibitions about my own uh, research projects. Often my research starts with uh, scientific images, scientific photography. The V&A has one of the largest and one of the greatest collections of photography, so I think anyone would be interested to, to work here and to do research here. During my residency, how I found photographs is really like how you would imagine it. You go into the archive, you really go into the basement, you open boxes which maybe have not been opened for years or even decades. The V&A has such a long history of collecting and working with photography, the amount is so immense. There are so many images which are not uh, looked at enough, I think. From the beginning I knew that I would not focus on the images, on the photographs, which are the very well-known artistic works, which are fascinating. But I thought, no, I would like to look at something different, at images which are maybe not looked at uh, enough before. Images which were used in the museum as documentation, as reference. All the images which were, which were just used as tools, and maybe not primarily as uh, artistic works. With my installation, the cabinets with their confined space forced me to, to concentrate and to select a smaller number of images. So we had to establish an order, you had to establish categories. The category remote in cabinet 56 shows three images and they show mathematical models. And these models were made in the 1870s for the museum. Even if you don't understand the science, the mathematics, the geometry behind them, you can still be fascinated and amazed by these images. And I think this is a field which is actually the most interesting for me. This is all the different ways how you work with photography as a tool, a big part of the collection, which is, you can say, is slightly undiscovered. The cabinet which I gave the category MOVE, number 44, shows the portrait of a young woman. And actually we do not know who this woman was, we even do not know who took this photograph and for what reason. With my installation, I, I hope to arouse some interest for a part of the collection that's maybe a bit overlooked for the moment. And I also wanted to show how even images which are only scientific or only documentation can still be beautiful and interesting. <laughs>